guys, welcome back to Animal Wonders. I'm really excited because we have a new animal that I'd like to introduce you to. This is Mimi the Black Tufted Marmoset. She was illegally owned as a pet and she needed a permanent place to stay. What are you stealing from me? Oh, what? Now what are you gonna do? You're standing on it. There you go. Good girl. <laughs> Getting to know Mimi has been pretty interesting. She is a primate, so these guys are quite complicated with their behavior. So uh, we've, we've taken things slow and uh, just, uh, just seeing how she reacts to everything so that I can make sure that I react appropriately too. And so she doesn't get stressed out and she just lives a, a stress-free life with lots of pampering. I'm working on trying to get her to stand on my arm, but you can see that she's a little reluctant to, which is fine, we can go slow with that. She's like, I want to keep my legs on the little thing, on the little perch. Wanna come get it? I know, you know that it's too far for you to, here. Can I climb onto my arm? I know. Oh, I know. Do you guys hear the vocalization? She's complaining pretty much about that. She's like, oh, I didn't like that. We never try and force them to do anything. I would love to be able to do educational presentations with her. In order to do that, she'll have to sit on my arm or at least be comfortable enough with, with jumping onto me. And uh, right now she's not, she's not super comfortable doing that. Good girl. Nice jump. So we'll just continue to work on that as, as, uh, as we get to know her and continue her training. She's getting a little drink of water right now. We like to put a lot of uh, natural branches in here. I mean, this is a nice station for training, um, but, but this uh, natural branch with the leaves on there, she has to figure out how to move around. It's not like everything's set up perfectly for her to sit here and everything. She has to figure it out. Um, it's really good for, for all of her mental and physical well-being. Black tufted marmosets, they come from South America and some people try and make them pets. Um, she was illegally owned as a pet and uh, she was confiscated and um, she needed a, a permanent place to live. Now, I would not recommend having a primate as a pet in, in, in any world. They just, they don't make good pets. Um, you can properly care for them in captivity, uh, but they should not be considered a pet. Mimi's favorite things to do are <laughs> look out windows, which is why we made sure she had a, a really big window to explore. She's also really into fruit. She likes bananas the best, um, but she'll also eat a bunch of other kinds of fruit. She loves papaya and pear and apple. Because she likes fruit so much, it's been my go-to reinforcer for training. Good girl, nice jump. Yeah. So far, we've worked on a station behavior and a hands behavior so that she can, she can present her hands and hopefully I'll be able to trim her nails in the future. And uh, she, she's getting it really, really quickly. She's very smart and it's not like training a rodent where they're pretty much straightforward in their communications. Mimi can get a little bit tricky where she's like, I know you want me to do that, but I'm gonna do this instead. What are you gonna do? So it's been a challenge, but a fun challenge. Now, my goal is to eventually take her out on presentations and be able to educate about how awesome marmosets are. Yep. Well, Mimi decided that she wanted to explore the tripod. So she jumped right out and then she was having a blast out there and I'd rather her not be outside of her enclosure. It's not safe. So I went and got her in a crate and I'm gonna go ahead and close the door and let her out of her crate now. Hey girly, that was an adventure, huh? Do you wanna come on out? Here you go. As you can see, that didn't phase her at all. She is 
really quite comfortable. I'm really happy that she was comfortable enough to jump right onto the camera and, and wasn't scared of Matt back behind the camera either. That shows a lot of promise that she's going to be comfortable in front of an audience. So that's really exciting. I'm excited to keep you guys updated as Mimi progresses in her training and our trust bond solidifies. Thank you for going on this little adventure with us. If you would like to continue going on adventures with us, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Animal Wonders Montana. And if you'd like to buy some housewarming presents for her or little toys, you can check out our Amazon wish list. Link is below. Thanks guys. Thank you.